um, loves to just walk around the house and chase the dogs. <laughs> everybody. Raylan, what are we up to today? We're going to show more animals. More animals, that's right. We have a couple animals that don't fit into any of the other categories, like uh, with our cressids or our, our geckos. So these are the other amphibians and reptiles that we have. So we'll show you those in a second. Hey Robert, who do you have? This is Inferno. He is our fire skink. He's uh, approximately three years old, full grown. Um, I don't remember what the name of the vendor was where we got him, but we got him at uh, um, NARBC Schomburg. That one I do remember. Um, we did a video and we got him on the Schomburg show, so you should check that out and you can figure out the vendor because I can't remember his name. Um, I don't know if he's wild caught or if he is uh, captive bred. I do know he's missing a toe somewhere. Yeah, he's missing a little toe right there on his foot. But uh, he is, <laughs> once you finally catch him, he's hard to catch. He likes to hide and burrow but once you catch him he's really mellow he just loves to be held i will hold him for hours he'll just sit just like that for hours and i'll be like playing video games or watching movies and he's just chilling out robert who do you have this is venus she is our bearded dragon look how gorgeous she is um we got her uh the owner's daughter well the owner went to college and we got a phone call and said, hey, you guys want to come get a bearded dragon? My daughter's going to college and can't uh, keep her there. So we decided to rescue her. She's, what, about eight years old now? Maybe older. We don't Maybe know. Maybe older. We're not exactly sure how old she is, but she's had fun life. She's gotten fat since we got her because we like to feed her a little bit too much. She loves to eat her worms and her vegetables and crickets and whatever, anything we put in the cage, basically. Even little baby pinky mice yeah. and rats, don't you? She just loves her food. Look at her. She's just like, yeah, this is our little baby dragon. Hey, Robert, who do you have? This is Shortcake. She is our Pac-Man frog. Pac-Man frogs do not like to be held. If you don't know what you're doing, don't hold them because they like to jump and it could hurt them. But uh, she is a strawberry Pac-Man. That's why we named her Shortcake. She just had a nice little soak because she was... She's been buried for quite a while. She likes to bury herself. And uh, they have like, they shed just like any other animal. And she had a nice little layer of skin we had to get off of there. And yeah, that's uh, Shortcake. She's actually being really good right now. I got to get her put away so she doesn't get hurt. Robert, who do you have? Mike Wazowski! This is Mike Wazowski. We don't know if Mike is a male or female. Um, I wanted to get a sulcata tortoise. And that's what Mike is. And I wanted to name it Sully. But Ranlin stole the name Sully for our Lichianus gecko, so I decided to go with Mike Wazowski. So this is a, a spurred legged tortoise, or sulcata tortoise is what they actually are, but people call them a spur legged tortoise because of the spurs on their front legs. And uh, when they get older, you can't tell their sex until they're, what, seven or eight years old or something like that, some insane amount. And uh, he's just goofy, or she, it. You know, Mike Wazowski is very goofy. Has a great personality. Um, loves to just walk around the house and chase the dogs. <laughs> it's hilarious. You got a coon hound getting chased by a, by a sulcata tortoise. So there you have it. That uh, finishes up our reptile room. So if you haven't seen all of our other videos, like the cressids and the other geckos and uh, the snakes and the tarantulas, yeah, make sure you guys go check those out. So uh, this was our... Other animals that didn't fit into the other categories, the amphibians and reptiles and such, and a tortoise. <laughs> Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, leave a comment. Thanks for watching.